Hey guys, so we're here in Chiang Mai and the reason we came here is because it's the Yiping Festival. So we're here and we're gonna light this one up today. So join us as we go light it up. <laughs> You guys can see everybody's out and we're all heading towards the river. It's gonna be beautiful. Oh look, it's a dragon. Whoa, this place is packed. Hey guys, we just passed the old city gate and it's really packed tonight. And I think there's a couple things going on. There's like a fashion show back there. Wow, look at this huge moon. That was a great decoration for the Yiping Festival. It's an ancient festive event tracing back to the ancient Lana Kingdom in the late 13th century. It's celebrated to mark the end of monsoon season and the beginning of cool season. So this event that we're at right now is called Loi Katrong, but it takes place during the Yiping Festival, which also happens to be on a full moon or lunar eclipse. Wow guys, we're here yeah. at the city gate. Look at all these people, look at all these decorations. Performances. Let's see, what do we got going on here? Oh, it looks like a Thai beauty pageant. Wow, they're dressed very nice. G2, G2, G3, G5. Almost. And it's, I know you guys can't tell, but there's a lunar eclipse tonight. It's already started. Oh, look, they're wearing traditional chai clothes. Oh, wait, what's it called again? I remember I looked this up. Uh, oh, yeah, Chu Tai. Pretty cool. Oh wow, look, it's violin players. Man, I've always wanted to learn to play the violin. They're playing very beautifully. Classical music is definitely a work of art. Shout out to Two Set Violin. Oh my gosh, you guys, this walk has taken forever. A total of like literally 30 minutes with kids just to get there, but we're almost there. And we finally made it to Ryan. Bridge. I will be using you later, Chuck Chuck. Because this walk, whoo, not easy. What's that? Is that a temple entrance? I don't know what that is, but it looks very nice. It's got some lanterns because it's the Yi Pink Festival. So exciting. And we're walking down this long long road it was a long walk to get here and we made it we're at a gate oh. i hear fireworks you guys yes that is very true for any of you people out there who are watching, make sure to hold on to your little ones when going to big events like these, or any events really, because there are so many people and they won't see them. She's wearing a really pretty dress. Oh look, there's somebody else wearing a dress. And another one. Oh, you know, they must be pageant contestants. Like we made it you guys <laughs> I know I keep saying that but I think this is really the spot this is the uh, and then, excuse me if I pronounce this incorrectly Nawa Rat Bridge Nawa Rat <laughs> Bridge Woo! we made it let's go lights our floating lantern all right guys so we made it and it's a lot more crowded than we thought so here I go. I am going to be doing this. 
So join me as I go first person to light it. All right, guys, here I go. Uh, here I go, you guys. This river is huge. Well, I shouldn't be surprised. I've seen so many, but still. All right, here I go. Send your wish away. on what this means the candle venerates the buddha with light while the grathrongs floating away symbolizes letting go of all one's hatred anger and defilements sometimes it's good to just let go thank you so much for watching you guys hope you enjoyed the water lantern festival as much as we did don't forget to like comment and subscribe and hit that notification bell so you can see where our next upload is thank you bye